today's video regarding Canon Pixima TS5050 all-in-one printer I'm going to show you how to do the copy print and scan so we are going to use simple copy and then we will do the wireless printing and scanning let's start with the copy now the first thing is to switch on the printer and press the power button load a4 size sheets at the rear paper tray and open the paper output tray which is here now take take the screen out now open the top scanner lid and place a page facing downwards on the left hand side corner and close the lid on the display panel we can see there is a copy option click ok click ok for standard copy now if you want you can change the number of copies you can select color black or white once you are ready just hit the start button which is a green button so here we can see it has done the copy now the next thing is to do the wireless printing and scanning for that we need to go to the display panel of the printer and click on the home button and here we have to go to the setting option click ok and in the settings click ok again click ok on device settings click down lens settings and look for wireless direct click ok so wireless direct activate click click ok and switch it on and to display in the information click yes so here is the name of the Wi-Fi direct and below is the password of this print now go to your Android device now go to your Android device and open the Wi-Fi look for the printers name here so that is direct TS5000 series and click on that enter the password as it is displayed on the screen and click on the connect button you will see it is connected now go back and open the Canon print app you can download it from the app store if you don't have it now go to the main screen you will see there is a printer displayed here so click on that and now on the top of the screen we get option add switch click on that and here we have old printer so we can delete it now here we see register printer button so click on that on the next screen it will display the TS5000 series click again and just wait for the printer to add up instantly here so once it is added you will see this screen that means your printer is that means your print is ready so click cancel for example to do a scan we get option here so click on the scan button now open the top scanner lid and place the page facing downwards on the left hand side corner and click on the scan button so here we can see the scan has been transferred if you want you can add more pages and click on the scan button or you can just exit and then it will show you where it is saved so it is saved in a folder and you can just go and access from there so once it is done we can go back and I'll show you how to do the wireless printing so you will see the section document print click on that and here you can select any document you want to print for example this is the one I'm going to do click on the next button and you can just select the page you want and click OK and click on the print button so here we can see so it's doing the printing so overall I can say it's a very good feature of the printer we can use it for the wireless printing and scanning also uh, you can just do the scanning with any device thanks for watching